Alright, uh, I'm actually, I'm recording now. <laughs> I'm gonna record this adventure. What is going on, gamers? I am here with another fella from BuzzCut Interactive. Uh, you know him well, Klaus Budvig. How are you doing today, Klaus? Um, um nope. nope. I'm changing. I'm, hello, I'm playing. Well, uh, we're playing some AI... So, sorry, sorry. You, you go on. No, no you go on. I was done. Uh, we've been playing some AI dungeon, and basically, what we're doing in AI dungeon is we're with this uh, no no. Why did I say no? We're this guy called Krog the Destroyer. Uh, and he can summon birds, and he's like, and we're looking for a legendary man called Ben Ten, who uh who defeated the dragons of the planet Zanzablorb. <laughs> And, uh, uh, so yeah, we teamed up with Krog, and we're going to find Ben 10. Okay, say, let's get on these birds so they can fly us to the airport. They get on the birds and they fly them to the nearby airport. It takes them 20 minutes to get there. And they walk into the airport and go to the ticket counter. Say, Hello. I would like to purchase three plane tickets to Z Zanzablorb. Wait, hold on, I gotta check. Yeah, that's the correct spelling. The un uniformed attendant and says, You wanna go to the Zanzibar? It's very dangerous over there. It's full of dragons and uh, other dangerous creatures. We can hand. Do we. L do we look like we care? <laughs> Well, you, you could look like a little more like you care, she says. Let's buy tickets. Then we'll see about looking more like we care. Damn! I thought so. So the attendant fills out the three plane tickets and smiles at them. That will be $350. Thank you, $350, please. Okay, uh, let's say... What? We don't have that kind of... Of money. Oh my god, this is perfect. Don't give her that money, says Krog. You've already given her money, says Krog. So he pushes the attendant aside and says, Here, you can have it. Okay, uh, this is getting confusing. Let's retry that. Let's re roll. Bunny fellow says, I don't have. What kind of money, cries the attendant? You have a dragon shard, you little imp. No, we don't! Shoots, I'm Wallace. Let's just get on the plane. I like to think that the attendant is just a crazy person. The attendant gives them $200. We don't need that. We have a dragon shard. Let us on the plane, please, says I'm Wallace. Yeah, we're going to redo that. We're going to redo that. This is confusing. I thank God there's a real option. So they get on the plane. The attendant smiles at them and says, And, and? Hold on. Bye. Then they leave. As the plane takes off, the attendant says, Oh my God, it's dying. Hold on. No. S says, Welcome to freaking funny airlines. No, wait, not freaking funny. Fecal airlines. You have a choice choice in flying. And you chose the wrong one. Enjoy the 
flight. Oh, for the love of John F. Kennedy. The seats and slump down and them totally exhausted. They sleep for 18 hours straight and wake up tired and smelling terrible. It's in front of him, his head against the window. He closes his eyes and tries to sleep, but he can't sleep and he can't relax. <laughs> Hold on, I've, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Go on. When all of a sudden, a man wearing all orange with a wielding hold on, I, I spelled that wrong wielding a a machete jumps out and decapitates the flight flight attendant. All right, here we go. Alan wielding a machete jumps out and decapitates the flight attendant, and then they all start to cut their throats. What? Looks out the window. A whole bunch of people running away in panic. Great, more stuff going wrong. <laughs> We're now approaching Zanzibar. The pilot says. The or the man wearing orange approaches the three the two hunters. My name is Joe Blow. It it is a pleasure to meet you. Now wait, ah, oh, I forgot. Bad luck. He then cuts open his throat and throws the body. Oh, no, we're gonna redo that. Why is everything going wrong today? It says, bad luck. And then, no, that's not. Man wearing orange approaches the two hunters. My name is Joe Blow. It is a pleasure to meet you. I almost gets up and extends his hand. William! <laughs> she says, and it proceeds to cut it off. No, why are we doing that? Man wearing orange. It's a pleasure to meet you. He sticks a knife into the neck of a sleeping man in the middle of the seat behind him. Anyway, you can g to give me a hand with the seat. <laughs> this is so trash. We're trying to make a good story. Same here, replies I'm Wallace. I hope you have a good reason for being in the dragon's den. I do indeed, says Joe. A very good reason. I'm gonna say something. What are you two... Talk talking about I'm confused. Oh my god, this is hilarious. I'm talking about catching the very Penyon dragon. The what? The dragon's so weird that it would be worth more than a trillion dollars. Oh my god, this is actually- this is actually extending into a really cool universe. Why is everything in dollars? <laughs> I don't get it. Because that is what this valley is- well, No it isn't, it's a freaking dragon! <laughs> this makes sense, actually. Super Earthworm. He's coming to help. So, uh, how's it going, Klaus? Not, Not too shabby. shabby. Um... Has the AR stopped? Hold on, no, I don't think it has. Hold on. Yeah. Since when was a valley involved?
It's unfazed by the youth of the two hunters. What? Don't look at me like that. You are an insane person. You killed the flight attendant. Don't look at me like that. You are an insane person who killed the flight attendant. I didn't kill her. She decided to join me. Oh, this is actually cool. Whatever. Let's just get this over with, shall we? Super. Uh, no, and that that's uh. The. No, don't call me Joe, and I will tell you all you need to know. Where do we start? I know where the dragon is, says I'm well- Uh, we're gonna re-roll that, I'm sorry. Well, how would we do that, Mr. Bonaparte? Call me Joe, and I'm not that old. Let's just go to Xanoblorb and see if the dragon is there. That's insane, shirts fella. That's something I'd say, totally. Because I, if you guys didn't know, I'm funny fella, uh, and I'm Wallace's Klaus. So, pull out a Glock. I'm gonna shoot a Joe blow. 17 and shoot Joe blow. Funny fella pulls out a Glock 17 and shoots Joe blow. What does failed to fetch mean? It says failed to fetch on my screen. Screen. It's well like nothing. Uh, come on, load, load, come on, load, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, come on, come on, do it now, you can do it, AI. Come on, uh, I, th falls out, uh, Glock 17, shoots stroke, uh, I didn't mean to do that, uh, I didn't mean to do that, uh, hold on, when is this gonna... Oh, yikes, this is a lot harder than I thought it would be. It's, we've been having to restart it a lot. Yeah, well, everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you had a great day, and enjoy your day.